Today we're looking at the interactive maps and more specifically the haplogroup concentration by country interactive map. This map requires some explanation. It's not quite as intuitive as the, uh, the pre, uh, prior uh, ethnic diaspora map. What we have here is the world of, uh, showing the statistics uh, of uh, the uh, haplogroup concentration. So let me just by illustrate by example. Uh, this first uh, selection here is the haplogroup percentage. So if I uh, take a country here, let's say uh, I'm going to go over here to um, Mali. Uh, what'll pop up there is the statistic. Uh, okay, well I had it over Tanzania first, but uh, it should switch over. Okay, to Mali. Uh, here you see the, the dis different statistics that are included in the map. Uh, the top, uh, the first haplogroup percentage is the 93.56 and the first haplogroup is E. That means that 93.56 of the population of this country is in the E haplogroup. And um, let's skip over the uh, greater thans for a moment. The second haplogroup concentration is um, is actually 1.77 percent and that's uh, the A1 group. Now these two combined, the combined percentage is 95.33. So the first two haplogroups combined represent 95.33 percent of the population. Now let's look at the uh, greater thans. First, uh, the first ha first greater than 51 percent um, says that uh, the first haplogroup represents more than 51 percent of the uh, population, and one and zero are just uh, it's just a uh, binary coding system that allows the map to display, as we'll show in a minute. Then uh, the next one, first and second greater than 51 percent, just, uh, just uh, means that the, the, f the first two haplogroups combined are greater than 51 percent. And the, the next one is first and second greater than 67 percent. The first two haplogroups combined are, at are greater than 67 percent of the population. So uh, what happens here if you select one of these greater thans is that the, the chart will display uh, the global um, distribution of, of, of that statistic and you'll see the countries that are greater than 50 th where one the first haplogroup is more than 51 percent in purple and in green the ones where the their f the largest haplogroup does not amount to more than 51 percent of the population and the same holds for the other greater thans uh, so you can take a look at the w at, at the essentially the dominance of the majority uh, haplogroups the the the, 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 the highest majority and the, and the next highest uh, majority haplogroup within the country. Uh, and you'll see that most countries in the world are, are quite um, uh, uniform in terms of uh, the, pers uh, the haplogroup majorities um, and, uh, and display a, uh, uh, the dominance of one or two uh, haplogroups. I'd just like to add that uh, all of the data that's uh, presented in the Atlas of Genetic Ancestry is available for download. Simply go over to the Tools menu on the side and, uh, and select Data, uh, data Download. Um, you can also take a look at the uh, information describing the, the methods and sources on that Tools menu as well, so uh, feel free to uh, explore the site.